Shoo! What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back. As you can tell, it is cold. Well, it's cold outside and it is cold in the shop. It is not a normal video today. Today is not your typical shoo upload, okay? Wow. Hey, how's it going, dog? How are you? Um, today is a little bit different. This is going to be my last video on YouTube for, for a while. I mean, when I say a while, I mean quite some time. It's not clickbait. Um, so, I mean, I will, let me just start with this. This decision was made a long time ago, okay? This decision was made like probably maybe back in July or August. So I've kind of known it's coming, but I didn't know a lot as far as how to handle it, what, the, what it's gonna look like. Um, so I am taking a break from YouTube, a significant break. Now, your number one question I'm assuming is, how long is this break? going to be is this is this three days is it three weeks is it three months is it three years um, the question is I don't know okay I don't know um, how long it's gonna be significant okay now let me just backstory this you know if you guys are new here or if you've just watched my channel for the last year or two or three I've been doing YouTube for almost 10 years okay long time I am 24 in case you guys are curious so I mean 10 years, I mean, I was 14 when I started. I mean, I've been doing this not half of my life, but pretty darn close. Um, as an adult, YouTube's all I know. It's all, I, it's all I've done um, since I was you know, a teenager. This is all I've really done. It's all I've known. Um, you know, YouTube's been, and obviously it's been a major part in my life. It's, it's, I mean, I've been doing it full time now for seven years. So, you know, three of those years were me just you know, messing around, which I, mean, I feel like all 10 years was kind of me messing around. But, you know, it's been my sole source of income and job for seven of those 10 years. So a long time, right? I've been doing this a long time, been on this platform a long time. And over the 10 years, I have never taken a break. More than, I think the longest I've gone without uploading over the last 10 years is maybe, maybe a week, maybe. But I would say in the last, since it's been my full-time job, so last seven years, I don't think I've gone more than four or five days without uploading. I mean, I upload three to four videos a week, every week, for the last seven years for sure, since it's been my job, um, but probably even longer than that. So as you can imagine, it's uh, it's been a heck of a ride, and I love it, and I enjoy it, and I'm not complaining. This is not supposed to be a "you guys should feel bad for me" video. Honestly, my life is amazing, and uh, there's really nothing I can complain about um, when it comes to what I do for a living. I mean, it is truly my dream job. There's not much else I could think of that I'd rather be doing than what I do right now. But with that being said, over those ten years, or even seven, that I've really been doing it hardcore full time, lots have changed. I've uh, I've moved houses, I think, three times. I don't know what that has to do with any of this, but I'm just trying to tell along, I guess, tell the story. Um, I've gotten married and I have a child. That's the biggest one, right? Biggest life changer. You dads out there know what I'm talking about. You're like, ho oh, ho, see? Flair knows what we talk about now. You have a child, changes some stuff. And I wouldn't change a thing. I absolutely love my daughter to death. She is the best thing that has ever happened to me by far. Um, but with that being said, at anything I do, I always want to be the best. So now that I'm a dad, I want to be the best dad in doing what I do on YouTube, which is filming and editing four-ish, sometimes more, videos a week. It's really hard to spend quality time uh, with Macy, my wife, or my daughter, Brooklyn. And so, you know, I knew we had Brooklyn in October, for those of you guys that don't know, it's great. Um, but obviously, you know what October is, right? Prime time hunting season. I will say October, November, December were the hardest months that I can remember in my life. Um, Stress-wise, um, obviously, you know, lack of sleep with the, with the newborn. I mean, it's just very difficult to balance everything. Um, you know, give Macy the time that she needs um, for me to, you know, help her in raising our daughter and all that, but then also still upload, you know, four videos a week. And then if you guys had tuned into Lojo's podcast, you kind of know the dilemma with like the camera guy editor stuff. So like, it, it, when it rains, it pours. Let's put it that way. Uh, but I don't want you guys thinking because of the, what happened this fall is why I'm taking the break. I made this decision 
way before, I mean, back when Zach was my camera guy, right? Back when the summer when we were doing catfishing videos, I made this decision. I knew I'm, I'm having a daughter in October and I knew I would be, it would be a struggle. And I, I underestimated the struggle, I'll be honest. I mean, it was, it was, uh, it was way harder uh, than I expected to balance everything. I wouldn't say just raising my daughter has been a battle. I mean, it's, it's, it's a baby. I mean, it's it, it, pretty common sense there as far as what, you know, you don't have much sleep, you know, you're doing much stuff, whatever. Um, but then the YouTube side of thing, it was like the YouTube was the hardest. It was my hardest probably fall ever on YouTube um, just because the team that I had was really non-existent um, for, for the fall, you know? And so anyways, it was super tough. Let's just put it that way. But I don't want you guys thinking because of that, that's why I'm taking a break. Now I'm thankful I'm taking a break because those were some hard times and I would like to take a breath and re-strategize. But I also don't want you guys thinking this break is literally me, you know, going to Cancun and kicking it. That, you know, I kind of wish, but no, not at all. I mean, I plan to work seven days a week, um, you know, all the time, basically throughout this break, but it's not focusing on YouTube videos, right? Thinking of a great title, a great thumbnail, four times a week, getting the crew together, going out, executing it, filming, editing it, posting it, and then doing it again four times a week. That's what I'm trying to take a break from, not work. Now, what I'm gonna be doing over this break, some of you guys might be wondering, is obviously trying to be the best father I can possibly be to my daughter, being the best husband I can to uh, to Macy, and really you know, trying to make up for the time that I spent in the woods hunting and filming and stuff like that when she was kinda on her own um, in the first few months of our daughter being born. I'm trying to not make up for it, I know you can never make up for that, um, but really just try to make it easy on her. Do whatever I can to make Macy's life easier um, and try to kinda relieve her as as I'm taking a break, my break, I'm taking a break from YouTube to then help her so she can kind of take a breath as well. Um, it is healthy for everybody. So it was good, good timing in that, in that sense. You know, right now, obviously, like I said, I'm bundled up right now, even in the shop, it's, it's negative six outside. Another reason why the break is happening, the, you know, the months of January and February are always really tough um, for me to make YouTube videos. I mean, you can ice fish, you can hunt a little bit, um, but it's not overly enjoyable, right? I would, I would much rather take a chill pill now and then hit it hard again in the spring when the fish are biting, right? Or the, and the turkeys are gobbling. So timing's right. I'm just, the reason why I'm telling you guys all this, so you understand what I'm doing and why I'm doing it. And you guys, I, I kind of want to answer all the questions. But before we get too far into it, one thing I want from you guys, okay? I only want one thing. That's all you got to do. I want you to drop a comment down below some video ideas for when I get back. What kind, think about this. This is going to be probably in the spring. I don't know. It might be March, it might be April, it might be mid-February, probably not mid-February, but like, you know, I'm hoping to take a month or two um, and I'm hoping that'll be enough time for me to feel good. I'm not gonna come back until I'm ready. I will say that. I'm not gonna come back until I have a team, until I've got a solid team, a legitimate solid team um, of people, of filmers, of editors, of everything. Um, that's basically a, another reason why I'm taking the break too, so I can really focus on hiring quality people. And I'm, and the, you know, like Banjo's still around. I'm not like canning Banjo and replacing Banjo or anything like that. But um, you guys saw in the last, some of the last videos that I filmed, uh, you know, Pool Jet was back, so there might be something there. We're not really sure. We're still working out some some kinks, um, but you know, I've got some really good people around me right now. It's just you know, get, finding the roles that they want to be in, and then you know, letting setting them free, kind of giving them responsibilities. Just building a team, right? We, you kind of have to look at this like, yeah, I'm a YouTuber, but there's a lot of moving parts, right? And you want to have the the best team you possibly can to create the best videos for you guys. So part of the break is assembling a super solid, bulletproof team. Uh, over the next few months here. So when we do come back, we hit it harder than ever. I mean, I wanna come back with just an absolute fire under everyone um, and deliver the best video. So that's all I need from you guys for watching this video. Just comment down below and, and you know, do whatever you want. I'm not gonna tell you guys what to do, but you know, try to be a little specific, right? Don't just be like, Flair, I wanna see you fish more. Like, yeah, I, I wanna fish more too. But like, you know, what kind of videos do you wanna, do you wanna see? Do you wanna just see the catch and cooks? Do you wanna see catfishing? Do you wanna see, you know, we started to get a little bit into the ATV go go-kart space? Do you want to see more on that? The mini Jeeps, do you want to see more on that? We just got a welder. Do you want to see some welding videos? Like what type of videos do you want to see thinking about, you know, it being spring? Obviously, yes, we're going to make turkey videos. Yes, we're going to make bass fishing videos. Yes, we're going to make catfishing videos. But give us some ideas. I want this entire comment section to be absolutely chock full of video ideas that you guys want to see. So then we can create them for you when we come back and deliver the best videos possible for you guys. So that's all I need from you guys is just a comment down below. We will be back. It's gonna happen, I just don't know. I don't wanna give you guys a date because I don't want to. I wanna make sure I come back when we're ready, right? It's like, 
it's almost like I got injured, right? Playing a sport, football or something. And it's like, you can't really say like, yeah, I mean, it's probably three to three to six weeks, right? You'll be back. But you know, at week four, if you're not recovered, you don't want to come back. I feel like it's somewhat the same here, right? Once I feel good, once I've got the team established, um, you know, once, you know, I've, I feel like, you know, Macy's doing well, the Brooklyn's doing well. We've really kind of established that deal, taking some time for the fam. Um, then I feel like I'm ready to come back and hopefully be swinging harder than ever. Come back strong. I mean, I don't want to, uh, I don't want this channel to fizzle out or, or go down. I mean, this is really just take a break and then hit it back harder than ever. The other thing I want to mention is although I am taking a break, as you guys know, we launched Uncut Outdoors. And so I will still be posting on Uncut. Now, I'm, they're not going to be full blown hunting vlogs or fishing vlogs or anything like that, but it's going to be a lot about the behind the scenes. Like I said, my break is not me going to Cancun and sitting on a beach. There's still projects to be done. There's still stuff in the shop to be built and, and tinker with and, and organize. You know, I need to reorganize parts of my house. Like there's a lot of stuff going on. Equipment needs to be serviced. You know, all the land, all the, you know, the properties I have still need to be managed and, and checked on. And, you know, we got a snowstorm. We got to go plow the roads, all that good stuff like that. So I am still going to be filming that stuff. It's super behind this. It's stuff that I'm not doing for YouTube. I'm doing it because I have to do it. It's part of, you know, my life and having properties and responsibilities and whatever. Um, so I am going to be taking camera with me on those adventures. So if you are wanting to see like the behind the scenes stuff, it will be posted on Uncut, which is linked down in the description down below if you guys wanna go check it out. Um, like I said, it's not anything that you guys are going to miss out on here on YouTube, thinking, oh, Flair's you know, leaving YouTube just to post on Uncut. Like, literally, that's not it at all. I'm telling you, whether I have a camera or not, these are the things I'm going to be doing anyways, but I might as well bring a camera, show the behind the scenes. If you guys are not a part of Uncut, it's an amazing community, and everyone in that community just wants to see the behind the scenes stuff. They wanna see the stuff that doesn't get posted on YouTube, the you know kind of the more in-depth stuff right like on youtube i try to post like the highlights it's like the highlight reel right it's like instagram uh, but on uncut i kind of post everything it's uncut it's raw you see everything you see the good things the bad things everything in between um so i will say if you guys are watching this and you're a part of uncut don't worry, you're still going to get content over these next few months that I'm taking a break from YouTube. Um, like I said, they're not gonna be full-blown vlogs, but you know, I go down to the animals today and you know, Dale broke his leg again, right? That's all gonna be on camera. It's just, I'm not gonna be forcing stuff. I'm not gonna be doing stuff for YouTube. I'm gonna be living my life and bringing a camera, and if something interesting happens, then it'll make the cut, right? Um, so to speak. So anyways, again, it'll be linked down below. So if you guys haven't checked out Uncut, this is a good time to go check it out, uh, but I promise you guys, you're not missing out on anything, uh, you know, extravagant and important um, as far as, you know, I'm not going out there and making full blown videos for Uncut and then not posting them on YouTube. You guys are always my priority. You guys know that um, when I, when we started Uncut, the goal was to give creators like myself and other hunting creators a place to post Uncut footage, especially like the hunting side of things, have a safe place um, and be able to make some money, reinvest it in the content and make really good content for you guys. It's never been, the goal has never been to replace YouTube um, and force you guys to go over there to watch my my videos um, or anything like that. It's, it's supposed to just be a bonus behind the scenes content, stuff like that, a little bit more intimate intimate interaction, right? Like I post on there all the time, like, would you guys wanna see this video, this video? Should I buy this or should I buy this? Like everyone on Uncut basically just helps the whole system move for YouTube. And then I post, you know, obviously like the video on YouTube. So again, I don't want you guys freaking out saying Flair's selling out, Flair's just going to Uncut, Flair's selfish, he's this, he's that and whatever. Uh, I promise you guys, if you don't join it, it's not a big deal, okay? You guys you guys can, you're more than welcome. Uh, it, it's gonna be fun, we're gonna be doing some live streams and stuff like that, uh, but like I said, it's not, it's not gonna be anything uh, absolutely crazy. But if you guys are watching this, you are part of Uncut, I just wanted to assure you, there's still gonna be content. And, and, I, and I'm not the only creator on there. We've got like five or six creators on there and they're gonna be posting content as well. So um, it, it should be filled with content. Un Uncut should have plenty of plenty of stuff for you guys to watch um, on there if you're a part of it or, or want to be a part of it. Uh, but that's pretty much it, taking a break. So I don't really know how long it's gonna be. Um, I just, I got a lot of stuff to figure out. Got a lot of behind the scenes, a lot of business stuff, stuff that you guys don't really see. I mean, I've neglected so much stuff uh, for being on YouTube. YouTube is always my priority. Already I've put YouTube in front of. Unfortunately, family, friends, I mean, I, YouTube has been the top dog in my life. Anytime I have a decision of, do I do this or do I go film a YouTube video? I've always picked YouTube. YouTube has always been the number one, which isn't probably great. Um, you know, obviously it's got me to where I'm at today, uh, but 
you know, especially when it comes to family, especially with now that I've got a daughter, I mean, it's obviously, you know, where the priorities need to be. And I do too. And so I need a, this is part of me growing up, being a man, being an adult, right? And just being like, okay, dude, screw you two for just a little bit. You need to focus on your family and you need to make sure everything is good at home before you go, you know, mess around and start petting your camel and, and stuff like that. Anyways, hopefully you guys, I, I don't know if I should say enjoyed this video. I mean, again, it wasn't anything crazy. It's just informative. I just didn't want rumors speculating Flair left YouTube because of blank. You, Flair left YouTube because of this. The reason why I'm leaving is because of a decision I made six months ago. It has nothing to do with what's happened in the last couple months. That has definitely made me appreciate the break more, but it's not why I am taking a break. Like I said, I, I just wanted to clear the air on that, explain it, let you guys know that I am going to be coming back. This isn't a huge, you know, dramatic filled video, I guess. Uh, it's going to be weird. I'll be honest. I mean, it's weird. I've done this 10 years now, and this is the first time I'm going to be able to wake up and not have to think, what am I gonna film today for 10 years? I mean, some of you guys probably are 10 years old. Maybe you've been making videos longer than you guys have been alive. It's, it's strange, it's super weird. Um, but I'm confident, I'm confident it's gonna be healthy for me, it's gonna be uh, healthy for my family, it's gonna be healthy for my team that we're, we're, you know, we're working with and trying to expand and grow and, and really just kind of put together and uh, just kind of just re-strategize, ladies and gentlemen. I, I don't want you to think anything's gonna really change, right? I plan on coming back with the same old flair that you guys know. I'm not gonna come back and, and hopefully change much, um, but I wanna just really take some time, focus on the fam, focus on some stuff that I've neglected over the last 10 years, get all my stuff in order, and come back better than ever. But remember, if you guys are watching this and you guys are, you know, tune into the channel often, I would really, really, really appreciate it if you guys drop some comments down below of what kind of videos you guys want to see, video ideas, uh, comments, categories, kind of whatever, whatever you guys want to see. I, I would love to be able to read through this comment section over the break, jot down some ideas and really deliver so that way you guys are getting the content that you want to see. And remember, I will be doing a big giveaway right when we get back. So if you guys uh, are stay subscribed, uh, I would encourage you to watch whatever the first video is. I don't know what it'll be. Maybe it'll be something crazy. Maybe we'll buy something or maybe it'll just be a, hey guys, I'm back. I don't know what it's going to be, but we are going to do some giveaways. So stay tuned for that. And remember, if you guys want to stay involved in the behind the scenes stuff, as far as what I am doing during the break, it will be available on uncutoutdoors.com, which is linked down in the description down below. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. We will see you guys in a few months. Peace.